I'm Camille with SixSisterStuff.com and I'm excited to share with you one of my favorite soup recipes. Now that it's fall and the weather's colder, I'm all about soup. However, my husband does not think the soup is a main dish and so I've had to prove him wrong by making this big hearty soup and this one he will actually eat as a meal instead of as an appetizer. So it's basically all the ingredients that you would use to make a stuffed pepper but in soup form. So the flavor is spot on, it's delicious, and your family will love it. It's so easy to make too. You just need two pounds of ground beef um, and one onion chopped, and you just brown the beef and the onion together. So you can do this ahead of time um, to make it easy for dinner prep, and you're just gonna dump it in your big soup bowl. And then the next ingredient that you need are two green peppers, just chopped up. I try to do them kind of small so that my kids will eat them, um, they don't seem to notice it if it's chopped up tiny enough that they're bite sized. So two green peppers, throw those in, and then two cups of rice. You want to make sure your rice is cooked. So you can use instant rice, um, you can use brown rice, whatever your family likes. So you're going to put that all together and then you need two cans of diced tomatoes, the 14 ounce cans. I like to use the flavored tomatoes. This one has basil, garlic, and oregano already mixed in. I just think the more flavor you can get in this soup the better, um, but you can use any diced tomatoes that you have on hand. And then a fourth cup of brown sugar just to add that little bit of sweetness that is in the stuffed peppers that we all love so much. And then we have eight cups of beef broth. So you can just buy these huge boxes at the store or you can buy the cans, whatever is easiest for you. And then once you get that all dumped in there, sorry that's a lot of beef broth, you are just going to want to add one tablespoon of Worcestershire sauce. I think that's how you say it. If not, just make sure it's this one with the W. Just about a tablespoon. Um, it just gives it a little bit of kick and flavor. And then salt and pepper to taste as much as you like or as little as you like. And then you are going to simmer this over the stove for 30 to 40 minutes. And it will smell awesome. You will love it as soon as you... You start smelling it throughout your house it's the perfect soup for fall and then once it's done you can scoop it into your soup bowls um, I like to top it with a little bit of cheese but you don't have to you can do whatever you like and there you have it your perfect stuffed pepper soup for more recipes like this and more yummy fall soup recipes check us out at sixsisterstuff.com